Well, we're delighted today to welcome Mr. Who, who is a snooker superstar. At Oxford School, we want to provide opportunities for all of our children to excel. And one area that we wish our students to excel in is sports. And Mr. Who, who's a very famous snooker player in Hong Kong and around the world, is introducing snooker into schools in Hong Kong. We're very pleased to support that and hope that a lot of our students will undertake learning this new activity. So I'll ask Mr. Phil, can you tell us a little bit about why you think Hong Kong students will benefit from learning about snooker? Yeah, I think snooker is, uh, it's always been a very popular sport in Hong Kong, but I think to me snooker has always been a sport for adults. Uh, I started playing snooker when I was uh, maybe eight or nine years old, but the table was a little bit too big and too, too, too tall for me, and, and the queue was too long for me, so I think the sport is mainly for adults. So I've um, designed uh, a, a new snooker table and uh, custom made some snooker cube for children, and we're trying to bring snooker into uh, different schools in Hong Kong, and hopefully even have more uh, young children uh, to play snooker in the future. So, it's nice to uh, bring snooker into Oxford, Oxford School today, and a lot of uh, children really enjoy playing snooker today, so I'm very happy to see that. Well, we've just had a wonderful assembly with Mr. Fu and his master trainer, where we've demonstrated snooker to our children. I can tell you they're really excited and inspired to play this game. I'm sure that many of our students at Oxford will sign up. I'm sure in Hong Kong as well, many students will be interested in so thank you. Thank you for coming. Finally, can you give us some words of wisdom? How do you become a world champion? What can we say to young people to inspire them? What words would you say to young people to inspire them to become a world champion at their dream? And I think it's uh, very important to uh, have a dream. Uh, I think um, it's very important not to be afraid to dream very big uh, because I think young children or older people like us, it's, it's always important to, to have a dream and, and, and to, to do your best to achieve your goal. I think it's always very, very important. And I think uh, to find something that you love, um, uh, for me it's snooker. It's always nice to have a, a passion and every time I go on the practice table I feel that I really enjoy the process and, and I don't feel tired doing what I love, right? So uh, I think for the young students, first thing is to find something that you love and you strive for the goal. And, and, um, and it's always nice to have the family to support you as well, right? So um, yeah, hopefully young children will achieve the goals um, one day, and I'm sure that. Thank you very much, Mr. Fibber's words and wisdom, and for visiting Oxbridge School.